107.5 WBLS, your number one source for R&B. Let's go to MCA then. Okay, MCA. And you and Babyface actually might have had a crush on the same girl. Mm, kind of more, more. Um, <laughs> not, not really. <laughs> In not the really. book, that's what it says. Kind of, but it yeah. Uh huh. You said Babyface may have had a crush on the it same have, girl. It might have. And but, who but would that girl is, be? He and I never in our entire career had an issue with like liking the same same girl. girl. We didn't except and this time. I don't know if we did that time either. I just I just think I wrote that for effect. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, well, that lady was Pebbles. Absolutely. Right. And and um her, her and I became instant great friends. Mm-hmm. Like really instantly became great friends. It was many it was many 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 um hours later that we fell in love, but we, right. were, we were great yeah, friends. Yeah, and it would look like it might have been just hours. <laughs> but, you know, what was fascinating to me was the song Girlfriend and how you had offered it to Vanessa Williams. No, and she, she actually bought it. She was buying it. You said there was no exchange of they money, didn't though. didn't exchange the money. But okay. It was a handshake. It was a handshake. So you, you had so sold it. So as far as I was concerned, it was Vanessa's record. Right, Girlfriend. Girlfriend. And then what happened, and L.A.? Then, but then we met Pebbles. We went into the studio, we heard her voice, and Kenny says, Pebbles' is girlfriend. He said, that's who that song is, it's her. I said, well, we already made a deal with Vanessa. <laughs> he said, you made a deal with Vanessa. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I wasn't there. He said, Pebbles is girlfriend. Right. And we played her the song, and she went crazy. She offered $18,000 in two cars. Yeah. I bet she did get that yeah, song. She got the song. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and I bet and me <laughs> but I bet that Vanessa Williams never spoke to your butt again nope <laughs> she didn't she really didn't I think she may have said hi like 20 years later oh. like seriously like, and it was like oh Vanessa it wasn't me but how, how was it not me yeah. in her from her vantage point, right, 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 right. Anyway. Talking about this book, Sing to Me, My Story of Making Music, Finding Magic, and Searching for Who's Next. Now, we have gotten to the point where we've got a love struck L.A. Yes. And we are leaving Pebble's apartment, driving home, writes a song in the car. What song oh is God. that? Oh, that's great. Um, Every Little Step. Every Who Little Step, knew? Bobby Brown. Right. right. Who knew? That's my, that, that is my love song uh, to Pebbles, 100%. Yeah. And um, those words just poured out of me like crazy. Um, and you know, it's funny. Kenny and I wrote so many songs together that oftentimes we forgot who did what. Mm-hmm. Um, and he didn't actually remember that that's how the song came about. Right. And I had to remind him of it because we just did so much right. at the time. But that was... You know, that was really one of those moments, like driving down Santa Monica Boulevard. I had to pull over to the side of the road, and those words just came out. I can't sleep that night. Mm-hmm. I toss and turn, listening for the telephone, and when I get your call, I'm all choked up. I can't believe you called my home, right? Because yeah. I really felt like that. Really? Because I felt like she was like a higher caliber girl that I'd ever been around, you know? Yeah. I, I'm from yeah. the hood. Yeah, and you know what? And I, I think you, you fell in love with many facets yeah. um, of of Pebbles because you were hanging around with her f- a lot and yeah. going places. And, and then what I didn't know was that she was married at the time. See, now you're going to get me all Now, we move forward because, you know, I mean, matters of the heart, it happens. Yeah. Um, and then on page 89, I see the phone rang. It was Pebbles wanting to know what I was doing. I made some excuse, got off the phone, and went back to talking with Paula Abdul, oh God. who was at your house. <laughs> Suddenly, somebody was can knocking we, on my door. Can we fast forward? Like, I, I opened the door, <laughs> and there was Pebbles, never taking her eyes off me. She walked past me into the kitchen, grabbed a broom, and started shattering all of my glass furniture. At what point did you not say, okay, maybe this is not the relationship for me? No. Right then, I was like, will you marry me? <laughs> How? I don't know. Men just They're, love the yeah, little, you know, yeah. their lady with a little cray-cray. A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Is that There's true? no boredom in cray-cray. Right? Right? Yeah, they keep it going. But you got to, I don't know. There's something. Because then. No, women like to be f- 
women love that someone will fight for them. Well, men love yeah. that too. I mean, within reason, you know. But but you you want to think that you're important enough to somebody that they're willing to fight for it, right? Yeah, fight maybe but, put a little <laughs> fight, but not I'm break to make up all this your make, sense. I'm not make all your well. break all your your glass furniture, and then you try to move on. You try to break up. Yeah. Before you go on tour. Yeah. Right. I did. And next thing you know, Pebble leaves her husband, rents an apartment in your building. Packs up the clothes of your stand-in girlfriend, right. takes it back to her in Solar, <laughs> oh herself, God. and ends that relationship for you. Yeah, you still didn't see anything wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Not a thing. Not one thing wrong. No, no. Oh my God. Because then that you go on to say you surrendered. Yeah. LA. Yes, I did. So. I guess there was no other relationship. What do you mean? Where you felt this person loved you, and this is how this was a form of showing you that they loved you. Yeah, I liked it. Yeah, I did. I, I really did. No, I think the there next song no you should have wrote should have been "Help, please, somebody, please <laughs> help." Somebody, help. <laughs> Not just anybody. So we're gonna play every little no, step. No, that's funny because that really is your funny. ode to Pebbles, and it that is. was the uh, chapter in your life. I mean, I think we all. She wrote me one too that I really love. What did she write? She wrote a song called "Always." On that her was for album. you yes. the, with Sherelle. Yes, with Sherelle. You want to play that one instead? No, let's play every little step. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we I'm get still that. business man. I'm getting the world. Right, exactly. Always. <laughs> 